So as you guys know, this is the external navigator. It connects directly to the unit here. I'm gonna actually leave this connected for you guys. It's gonna be in the unit, okay? This is doing exactly what the unit is capable of. This is an external display board, okay? So what you're gonna do, when you get here and, <clears throat> so let me, let me put it like this. This unit has an evaporator coil leak and that caused second stage to not work at all. So because there's an alarm on the system, we only got first stage working. Compressor A1 and A2. And remember compressor A1 and A2. So what you're gonna do if the system, if the area is too hot, you're gonna come here and you're gonna put the unit on test. Uh, the unit's gonna be running, but it's only gonna be running on compressor A1. Compressor A2 will not shut on because there's an alarm on the system. So a way to bypass that, you're gonna come here to the navigator. You're gonna go to service test. Don't ignore the alarm. There's always gonna be alarm because there's a leak in the system. System test, click on system test. If there's a password, it's just gonna be 1111, okay? You're gonna push enter, 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 enter. Go to test mode, you're gonna put test mode to on. You're gonna push enter. Okay, now it's on test mode. You're gonna go up to cool. Push enter. Be careful, this is high voltage, okay? All high voltage wiring and it is live. Be careful. You're gonna go to compressor A1. You're gonna turn that on. Push enter. Go down to compressor A2. Push enter. Push on. Enter. Make sure that they're on on and this is blinking and you're good to go. Push escape. 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 Run test. Just to view it, you don't have to go to run test, okay? There. What's up everybody, so you get here, the unit is running. Remember you put it in test mode, compressor A1 and A2 are engaged. All you're gonna do is go down to service test. You're gonna click on service test and you're gonna turn test mode to off. And that's it. The unit will shut down and it will start to reset. It will start to speed up the supply fan. And by speeding up the supply fan, Sooner or later, compressor A1 will turn on, and that's all that will run on this unit because of the issues that are you know, with the unit. And Bob is aware. Bob is working on it. He's going to order me a new evaporator coil and get all the repairs done. If you guys have any questions, call me if I'm available.